up, y'all? How y'all doing today? Before we get started, you know what to do. Go ahead and like the video. Leave positive vibes down below. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. Um, also, don't forget to hit that bell to be notified. Okay, y'all. So today, I am trying Dr. Prego's gluten-free black bean quinoa veggie. Yes, so um, five grams of protein is four burgers individually wrapped. Okay, yes, and I know I got these from Publix. They was on sale. I can't remember how much they were, but I know they was on sale because normally I see these all the time and I don't buy them. So they was on sale. And I got them. Okay. Um, and most of the time, well, really all the time, a lot of uh, even veggie burgers that's processed has a lot of sodium. This one has 290 milligrams of sodium, um, but they have 250 milligrams of potassium. So it's not that bad at all. Okay, like I said, it was my first time, so I already kind of start biting it. I don't have any mayo. My good mayo, I don't have any. Um, it's a veganese. So, it's like a vegan mayo. So, I just put some barbecue sauce on it. And it's really good. So, it's like a a black bean burger. Well, that's what it is. It's like if you had a frozen black bean burger, this is like that, but twice as better. But they have some black bean burgers. Um, they don't really taste right. No, this is very flavorful. Even before I even put the barbecue sauce on it. And it has corn, and then of course it has that quinoa. So like I said, it's my first I heard um, about this brand. And again, I just never really bought it. Um, and this brand is very, very good. You can kind of see, well, the corn, the seasoning that's in here. Really, really good. Um, five grams of protein, like I said. I mean, you can put whatever you want on your burger. You know. your lettuce, your tomato, pickle, however you want to season it. Yep. This is really good. Um, but yeah, so also just keep in mind of the um, sodium. Just keep in mind. But so far, this is a very good vegan brand very tasty um, the flavor <clears throat> really really good that's probably why it's so expensive but then you have some expensive brands that just taste nasty it just taste like cardboard like they didn't even put much thoughts or flavor they just didn't care. Okay. 
I believe we can get that brand from Kroger. And I'm pretty sure you can get it from Whole Foods. I'm not sure about Walmart. I don't really shop at Walmart. vitamin D from the sun. Alright y'all. Make sure you wash your hands. Wear your gloves if you're going out or your mask. Alright y'all. 
So, till next time, I will be seeing y'all later.